Oh, I just hope they don't make me buy a new adapter. I need the new hyperbong. You don't understand. This isn't like a consumer loyalty thing. It's Welcome to High On Life Store number 7923, your local Hyperbong Superstore. Please, no traveling of other patrons during the midnight launch. Okay. Well, well, well. I smell another mystery. I'm Pseudo, by the way. You know me. Hi, Pseudo. I'm a detective now. Yeah, you already oh know what God. I'm going to say. Try interrogating all the employees here. Well, that's a great idea. You're an even better detective than me. Hello, and welcome to High on Life. How can High on Life help you today? What do you Great sell question. here? <laughs> Thanks so much for your interest. We sell Hyperbongs and Hyperbong accessories. The latest model, the Hyperbong 6, is even capable of smoking humans. That's right. That hot new species you've been hearing about. High on Life Hyperbongs are the only way to get that fix. Wow, fuck you. Illegal? No, 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 not in any real sense. You must be reading some of our detractors on the internet or watching too many Clug Nugman speeches. Hyperbongs are totally humane and of no harm to anybody except the creatures you smoke in them. Right. Fuck you. High on Life employees are not authorized to admit that we have ties to the criminal organization known as the G3, but can I offer you membership in our High on Life care program? We actually prefer yeah. not to call it the slums. This is an exciting new up and coming uh -huh. part of town that we hope will attract a youthful new demographic ready mm -hmm. to spend their hard earned money on quality products. Speaking of which, can I interest you in a Hyperbong 6? Woo, I'm not smoking my crack. own species. Don't lose motivation. You're doing great, but you do get a D ranking because that one sucked. Wow, well, fuck you. Uh, 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 hello, hello, and welcome, welcome to High on Life. I'm Derek. Uh, they have an inhibitor uh, chip on their head. Professional today. Um, do, do, that makes sense, right? That, does that sound okay? I'm I'm new here. God, I really love that. Sorry, Tyson. You look very cool, but no, sorry, I, I, I have no clue. How do you like working uh, oh, no, here? It's okay, I guess. Uh, it's the big Hyperbond 6 Midnight Lunch, and we literally just opened. So, uh, i only been here for like half an hour. And honestly, okay, yeah, it kind of sucks so far because, like, I can already feel my soul leaving my body. Wow. Have you used oh, a Hyperbond? No, no, I'm, uh, I'm straight edge. I don't even like thinking about drugs. This job was, uh, well, it was a bad idea for me, probably. Hey, hey, it's yeah, my first day. Uh, can you do me a favor and not mention Dr. Giblets around here? They told us not to talk about him. Uh -huh. Wow, nice kid, but not helpful at all. You get a big fat D ranking. Fuck you. It is my pleasure to welcome you to High on Life. Are you being helped already? Uh, what's oh, hyperbong? I'm so excited you asked. A hyperbong is a device used to absorb the life energy of another species in order to trigger a psychedelic effect in the operator. Okay. Does the store have any G3 I'm connections? I'm so sorry. That is a really fantastic question, but I'm not authorized to answer it. Have you considered buying a drop proof case for your hyperbong? The tours approve the store's High construction. Life employees politely request that you don't alert the other customers to the fact that we are part owned by the Torg family. That worries the other customers, and we don't want that. <laughs> you know, I, about Dr. I can't Chiplets. recall whether or not I've heard that name before, but I'm actually much more interested in telling you all about the fabulous uh -huh. features that come packed in with the brand new Hyperbong 6. Ooh, boy, they really want to make that commission, huh? Sorry, but I gotta give you another D rank. Okay, oh, shit. This what is about you? House. Oh, 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 sorry. Hi, thanks for shopping at High on Life. I'm the manager here. Are, are you finding everything okay? That's so right. manager it's here? a big day. I didn't think there'd mm -hmm. be this many people lining up to buy hyper bongs. Probably a bad sign for our city. Huh? Do you like nah, hyper bongs? I think they're probably bad okay. for society overall, you know? I mean, uh, I don't have a problem with drugs in general, but hyper bongs are like, the drugs are living creatures and they die, and that seems a little fucked up, right? But yes. Hey, I'm the manager no of the shit. store that sells hyper bongs. I probably shouldn't be saying stuff like that. It's hypocritical. It's weird. I don't know. I'm just here. I'm just here. 
Where can we find out the Jibbo? This again. Look, man, I just work here. I don't know anything about the store or who built it. Or I'm, I'm kind of a fuck up. I lied on my resume. I got this manager gig. I never even met Dr. Giblets. I, I don't know what he looks like. I couldn't even point him out in a crowd. Slow down there, slick. You're saying you know Dr. Giblets? Yeah, yeah, sure I do. He owns this place. He never comes around, though. I don't really know where he is. Oh, where Dr. Giblets is. I told you. I have no idea where he is, and you're being really aggressive. Leave me alone. It's super fucking busy right now, and you're distracting the hell out of me. Okay, shit, not not so good. It looks like we've uh, hit, a, hit a dead end, so let's get the fuck out of here and just give up on being detectives. It's all done now. Wow. Oh, shit. Nice day for a shopping trip, ain't it? It sure is. I know I'd go shopping on a day like this. Except this wannabe bounty hunter doesn't seem to be shopping. That's right. Seems like they're poking their beak where it don't belong. It'd be a shame if something happened to your beak as a result if you catch our drift. Just when what? things start to look all rosy, two knucklehead lugs showed up to hassle us. You got a fresh mouth on you, kid. Be a shame if something happened to that mouth as a result. Out of my what? associate here, he's only got one good threat, but I assure you, he can back it up. That's right. A word to the wise. Stay out of this. Got it? We've got this covered. You get to meet a lot of cool, silly people when you're a detective. kind of forces you. Everyone should be Jesus a Christ. A body. This was classic mystery stuff. Except it seemed very obvious this guy was trampled to death. Uh, yeah. My friend Davy Glutes got trampled in the rush. Pretty sad, right? One moment he was there, next he's gone. Squashed. There's a tiny I need to clear up. Looks like we need to get our hands dirty and steal those mag boots off the stiff. Maybe we could climb our way out of this hole, see? Oh. I can't activate my guns, so how the fuck am I supposed to leave? Oh. Mag boots. Yeah, that's fine. You can totally take those mag boots. Detectives aren't perfect. Sometimes we steal property off a dead corpse. Oh my God. It takes to solve the case. <laughs> what the fuck? Hey, sick moves. You're making good use of those mag boots. You're using those things way better than David Glutes ever did. Look at you. This will be amazing in VR. Just saying. Fuck you. Get, get murdered by orphans. My new favorite gun. I'm I'm trying to figure out where to fuck to go. 
Oh, there it is. There's your message from Queenie to elect collect an augment. Election is about to end, so make sure you donate everything you have right now. Escape the orphans by frickin' teleportation. Confused. Where the fuck am I supposed to go? It says over here, but when I go over here. Oh. Mind you, yeah. I got it. Observing you. Hope that don't rustle your jimmies none. Because newsflash buckos, we're on your side. We uh -huh. like to formally apologize for how we treated you earlier. We didn't realize who we were dealing with. You'll have to forgive us. And we're sorry we still sound like we're intimidating you. Uh -huh. It's the only way we know how to talk. Our wives hate us. I see. So who are you two? We represent Magistrate Clug Nugman. Maybe you've heard of him. He's certainly heard of you. <laughs> yeah, we're friends with him. No shit, he's been helping us. <laughs> left or right, guys. Left or right. I'll let you guys choose this one. Oh shit, we can actually get the really good upgrade for this gun right here. The no shit. Bookworm, what's your decision? If you're still here. Wait, I know I can tell if Bookworm's here. Penis. Get right off. <laughs> well, Bookworm answered. <laughs> the Torg family, or what's left of it anyway, they got mixed up with a bad crowd. The G3 cartel. Or more specifically, Dr. John Giblet's PhD. And Clug wants it squashed pronto. He says you're the right bounty hunter for the job. Says you're already helping him. Says the G3 is our common enemy. We've got a lead on Dr. Giblet's. He's been warping all over, leaving behind a nice little warp trail for us. We're thinking mm -hmm. you can follow those breadcrumbs all the way to the gingerbread house. That way Clug okay. don't have to get his cute little hands dirty. You dig? You want us to kill him? We are already playing <laughs> Okay, this I'm choosing this one. Fast. Yeah, check out Dale Earnhardt Jr. over here. Let's say Who? somebody dies. Maybe Who's Dale Earnhardt Jr.? Well, should anything like that happen, we had nothing to do with it. We didn't even mention it. This conversation never happened. And Clug will be very grateful. Speaking of which, why don't you follow us? Clug wants to speak in person. We get to meet a famous guy? I feel like this is a trap. Oh, welcome back. Thank you so much for all your help. Yeah, they've been aces. Yeah, real pros. Hello. Sorry about those two. They can be a bit intense. Really, I don't know why they talk like that. 
But look, you've seriously done so much for me. I hate to ask for anything else, but this election is really close. And, well, keeping the G3 out of Blim, it's really gonna help me lock this in. Do you think you could, you know, deal with Dr. Giblets? Oh, that's a oh, good shit. idea. I think we were already gonna do that. Retired but race car driver. Dead oh, dead okay. End. Oh no, we can't have that. Let me just leave this map data right here on my desk. Not sure what might be on it. You're being hard to understand. Just tell us where Dr. Giblets is. Shut whoa, the whoa, fuck up, whoa. God. Even if this map data did take you to Dr. Giblets, we're not 100% sure it would be his actual base. You'll still need to do some detective work. Fuck yeah. And then you want us to, you know... Hey, 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 I can't officially tell you to do that. Not if I want to win this next election, at least. <laughs> Good luck out there, bounty hunter. Wow, look. That's going to be helpful. Thank you. This gun is not very smart. What sure did it say again? Dale Earnhardt Jr. How'd it go? I think really good. Cog may or may not have shown us where Dr. Giblets is. I'm a little confused as usual. That's great. I kind of regret not voting for him. Now get out there and kill Giblets. Uh, you seen Merv? Uh, no. Uh, why are you coming in? It's cold. He, uh, he took off as soon as we got home, but when I checked his cabin, he disappeared. Uh, I've never seen him this upset. I'm afraid he's gonna do something silly. That's funny. The guy hasn't come back yet either. Okay, uh, that was weird. I'm thinking I'm gonna wake up soon and find myself back I couldn't press anything. I'm hitting the A button. Maybe she saw him around. She knows him? Oh, she saw a photograph. You didn't show me one. Ah. What's going on? Unknown sector. Human heaven. I treasure it always with me. Though it's threadbare and worn since the day I was born. That's where I've already been. These are all where I've been. So it has to be this one. Either Scott didn't make it into time or simply just banished off the face of the earth. Why don't you try Sarah again? I don't watch NASCAR, so I wouldn't know him. <laughs> well, this seems pretty nice. I bet all the humans are happy here. Maybe not. Okay, now I'm more confused as where the fuck I'm supposed to go. Uh, oh, Zephyr. I didn't even see the fucking <laughs> thing, t mission guide that's supposed to tell me what to do. You, uh, you seen Merv? Uh, no. Which is probably this. The one that's glowing. <laughs> I used to. Ah. Oh. Once we arrive, I want to show everyone something. Something that I made. Everyone ready to see what it is? I I'm ready. Damn, maybe you should pay more attention more. <laughs> Fuck off. Anyways, everyone ready? In three, two, one. That exists now. Oh, 
Oh, you missed it, book? I'll kill these guys and I'll show you. Alright, just let me kill these bad. Nobody's orphans. <laughs> Sir, you're not even on the ground. Sir. <laughs> My glitching powers killed him. <laughs> Oh, he is alive! How are you alive? Is he still floating above the ground? No, he's just partially in a wall. This- this poor guy is being tortured by my glitching power. I feel bad for him. Kind of horrible using his portals all the way. Yeah. All right. Bookworm, I pay attention, and it, you'll see it. All right, you ready? In three, two, one. Yep. I was looking at the wrong spot before. <laughs> Neat. The highway's evolving. Oh, what the fuck? Yes, go kill your friends. Cause you're a fucking moron. Under my command, or go nuts and die. Apparently. Okay, that's all of them. That was pretty sad. But yeah, as you can tell, Aderna, a uh, bookworm already kno knows because I had them. Uh, proof check my site. Uh, I have merch now. Okay. So, yes. Don't twerk on me.
I missed. Got him! <laughs> he keeps hurting himself. Oh my god. <laughs> Sir! Are you good? Sir! Sir! Are you okay? Sir. <laughs> Should I mercy kill this guy? Cause he is stuck. Chat decide their fate. Do I murder them or leave them alone? <laughs> Just put the poor bastard out of his misery, okay. Where you go? Well he died somewhere. <laughs> the children have gone with him. <laughs> what happened to that guy? Okay, so how the fuck do I get over there? Oh, wait. I wonder if this is the... Um... I'm getting really crazy out here. I keep hearing Anna's talking about my new hype... About the new hyperbong that can smoke humans. I see. We might need to shave all that hair off our bodies to blend in better. Is she gonna go bald? I, 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 you I'm do dying. it first. I'm dying. Though. Somebody needed our help. Uh, oh, thank God. Thank God someone's here. Oh, I, God. I'm consciousness. Oh, oh. We stumbled across another body. It looked like a classic case of... Hey, what happened to you? A G3 base warped right through here. Right, 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 right where I was. And, uh... Well, well, it shot me uh, right in half. I got cut in half. A D3 base. That can only mean one thing. Not sure what, though. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God, I'm fading fast. Please, please, please just stay with me while I die. I, I, I don't want to be alone. I don't want to be alone. Do they still have a chance of survival? Who's to say? No way to know. Not even with all the blood half their body missing. We weren't going anywhere until it was over. No, no. It, it's my time to go. Oh, thank you. For, for staying with me as I die. Oh, just, just don't leave. Okay. Now I feel it. Here I go. Oh, I'm, I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh. And just like that, another candle is snuffed out in the wind. So cool. I won't judge you for doing that, but I will think less of you permanently. <laughs> 